tiny equation holds all the answers to the universe's secrets. Hubble's law tells us where the universe began and how it will end. In 1912, Vesto Schleifer observed almost all galaxies were moving away from us because their light was redshifted. Redshift happens when something moves away, the waves becoming stretched and turning red. Schleifer used redshift to find the speed, or accessional velocity, that these galaxies were moving away from Earth. 17 years later, Edwin Hubble discovered a proportional relationship between the recessional velocity of these galaxies and the distances to them. Hubble also calculated the expansion rate of the universe, this is called Hubble's constant. Hubble found the greater the distances to these galaxies, the faster they were moving away. The universe was not only expanding, but accelerating as it expanded. The recessional velocity of a galaxy equals the Hubble constant times the distance to the galaxies, Hubble's law. Let's try this. Pretend the dots on the balloon are galaxies, and the latex of the balloon is space. As the balloon expands, Point A moves away from point B at a rate like that of Hubble's constant. Point C is moving away from point B at the same rate. But when we measure the speed at which point C moves from point A, we notice that it's moving twice as fast. Note the dots themselves aren't moving. They're just being carried by the balloon. Similarly, galaxies are carried by the fabric of space-time. We can use Hubble's law to determine our distance from a galaxy and or the speed at which that galaxy is moving away from us. Let's do a problem. Say the Darth Vader galaxy has a recessional velocity of 1400 kilometers per second and the Hubble constant value is 70 kilometers per second per megaparsec. How far away is the galaxy? Well, first we're going to set up an equation using Hubble's law. 1400 is our value for recessional velocity, 70 is our value for Hubble's constant, and distance is our unknown. Isolate the distance by dividing both sides by Hubble's constant, and we get d is 20 megaparsecs away. Hubble's constant is the expansion rate of the universe as time goes forwards. We can use it to run the film of the universe backwards, galaxies getting closer and closer together until all matters in the same place and time. Sound familiar? That's how we can use Hubble's law to determine the Big Bang. Because velocity is a measure of distance over time, 1 over Hubble's constant, known as Hubble time, gives us the age of the universe, which is about 14 billion years old. We can use Hubble's law to go back in time and to see the future. One little catch. Hubble's constant really isn't constant at all. It's actually speeding up with time, and the farther it expands, the faster it accelerates, which means eventually the universe will rip itself to shreds. I bet you're wondering who or what is blowing up this balloon. Though we don't know much about it, scientists are now looking to dark energy as the driving force for the accelerated expansion of the universe. It's truly amazing how such a tiny equation has unlocked the greatest mysteries of our universe, showing us where it began, where it's going, and even directing us to the origins of our very existence.